Hi, my name is Walt Carfora, and I'm a Social Security Disability Attorney. Today, I'm going to tell you if you should apply for disability benefits. Whether you're likely to qualify for benefits depends on your age, the amount of education you've received, and the type of work you've done, and your medical condition. The disability examiner will use all four of these factors to determine whether you're capable of working. Your application for benefits will, in most cases, be denied if the disability examiner determines that your impairment imposes no significant limitation or will last less than 12 months, or you're now working or are able to work. Your impairment must be diagnosed by an acceptable medical source and documented with a medical history and clinical or laboratory finding. And your impairment must place significant limits on your ability to function at work activity. The younger you are, the more education you have, and the less physically demanding your recent jobs, the more limiting your disability must be to qualify you for benefit. If drug addiction or alcoholism is the real reason you can't work, the examiner will deny your application. Disability determinations are made on a case-by-case -case basis, and the underlying regulations are complicated. It can be difficult for even a highly experienced disability lawyer to state with certainty whether a particular claimant will qualify for benefit. Your case may be unique, fall on the borderline, or have some special challenges. That said, here are some general eligibility guidelines. You should apply for Social Security disability if you can't do your past jobs, and you're under age 50 and you can't work full-time at any regular job, or you're over 50 and have a severe impairment that keeps you from doing all but the easiest jobs, or you're over 55 and can't do any job you've held in the last 15 years. Hope you found this information helpful. If you live in the Tampa Bay area or elsewhere in Florida and you need assistance with your Social Security disability claim, here's my contact information.